It looks like a wig. And he's uh, maximising what he's got. This is dreadful. We want to know what you think of his haircut. His haircut? It's like, yeah. like a wig that's falling like... off. <laughs> just flapping in the wind. <laughs> he's got it's an awful receding hairline. He should just embrace it and shave it off. It's an interesting look. It's, um, it's not necessarily something that I personally would encourage someone to have going on, but he's obviously going with it and good for him. I know you shouldn't judge anything by like appearance, <laughs> but it, look, it looks a bit weird. It looks like we've been like, electrocuted or something. I mean, he's in, he's in motion, I guess, so, so maybe it's normally down. Would you go out with a guy who had a hair like that? No. Why not? No, personally. Because I prefer shorter hair. I don't, I don't know, I wouldn't judge someone on their hair, so it depends on the whole person, really. If we shaved it all off, I would. Or so if he actually came to the end, maybe. But not half a head of hair <laughs> doesn't really do it for me. <laughs> if he's bald, he should embrace the fact that he's bald. Yeah. yeah. Um, and not try with all of that. I wouldn't be hairist and go out with someone just because of what their hair was like, but I would maybe encourage them to reinvent the style slightly. Have, I have blue hair myself and sometimes it looks green and people still sometimes go out with me. If you had to name this style of hair, what would you name it? Alternative. The flying wig. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, it's kind of bald and it's like... What is, what is the opposite of the mullet? So it's business at the back, party at the front. So it's maybe, yeah, the reverse mullet. Half-hearted mullet. <laughs> Dead luck's gone wrong. <laughs> the ecstatic bird's nest. Half haircut Harry. <laughs> You've seen Planet of the Apes. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, that was so good. <laughs> <laughs>